A prominent voice on the front lines of the social justice movement, local attorney and activist Nakima Levy Armstrong is now an author. She's written her first children's book, scheduled for release during Black History Month. The book is titled, J is for Justice. All right, y'all, so I'm gonna read a few pages out of my book, J is for Justice. From the front lines to the head of the class, local activist and attorney, Nakima Levy Armstrong, has a story to share. Baby Joy loved living in the big city. Baby Joy is the main character in her first children's book, Jay is for Justice. I decided to write a children's book based off my experience out on the front lines fighting for justice here in Minneapolis and being able to bring along my young daughter. At the forefront of peaceful protests following the murder of George Floyd, Levy Armstrong's young daughter was there too. Well, I think that it's never too early for parents to teach their children about racial justice and the importance of using their voices to stand up and to advocate for the change that they want to see. Through words and illustrations, the book depicting a cycle of struggle and strength. We have had children who have died at the hands of police violence, children who have been impacted by racism and discrimination, and so they need to understand that they are a part of the unfolding story of American history. Personally, we have a duty to fight for our freedom. We have a duty to fight for our freedom. Levy Armstrong is starting a new chapter. Last fall, she underwent surgery to remove a brain tumor. To get to this place, you know, after such a traumatic event, not knowing if I would make it into 2023, and then having my book to look forward to, knowing that it would present me with an opportunity to come into schools and classrooms and talk to kids, it gave me a surge of energy and joy and hope. From the streets to the halls of Josie Johnson Montessori in North Minneapolis. When do we want it? Justice! When do we want it? Now! A voice for change. Levy Armstrong looks to the future. So I want to make sure to reach back to the next generation and make sure we're lifting them up giving them opportunity, encouraging them and affirming them because that's what they deserve. Levy Armstrong describes her book as an anti-racism book for kids and she hopes that it serves as a conversation starter. She began working on it two years ago. The book will be released February 21st.